is a team built from scratch at the beginning of the year. What does it say that you guys have got so far? Uh, well, I'd say it all starts with the, with the coaching staff and, um, you know, the trainers and the whole, um, like, those guys make everything happen. And uh, even you guys, you know what I mean? It goes down to the uh, good teammates um, and the great fans. Uh, we put it all together, and um, it was a great run. Obviously, we want to, you know, everyone wants to win a championship, but you, you got to start somewhere. And I think it was a, it was a great uh, building block for, for the organization and for the city, and um, we can't thank the fans enough. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen a team quite as close as you guys are. What and where did that come from? How? I don't know. I mean, I guess it's just it's just um, a, a good group of guys, um, well brought up guys that you know one common goal. We all we all want to win, and and um, you know, uh, a vet in the NHL once told me there's three three things you got to do to to make it. It's be a, be a good guy. Be a good teammate and, and have fun. So I mean, I think I think we got all three of those covered, and, and uh, it just shows. Um, even you know our coaches, he's probably he's one of the best guys around, and and uh, we all look up to him, and we all want to win for him. So it's it's a big. Uh, we did we did, did it for him, and not only each other, but he was a, he was a big reason for it. On the ice, what is it about the way you guys played that got you so far? Then again, again we play for each other. We we um, we have a lot of passion for the game and. Um, I mean, myself, I'm a, I'm a big emotional guy. I love the game. Um, I think it, it's kind of infectious to guys around me, and, and I try and I bring that every day. And, and uh, you know, it, it goes a long way and helps guys uh, want to win and succeed. Do you think you may be su- su- do you think you may be surprised some people outside of this building? Myself. As a team, As yourself, a team? what you guys did. For sure. I mean, um, I've heard a lot of rumors around here, like you know. It, they haven't had the best fan base in a while because they haven't had winning teams, but you, you got to start somewhere, right? And um, going in the second round, first expansion team, and uh, they haven't been a playoffs in what 20 years or something. So and hopefully that helps, the, you know, bring the fans out and, and uh, we can continue to have a winning organization here. Um, have you? How often have you seen buildings, especially buildings only like half full, be as loud as this one was in the yeah. playoffs? Um, no, it was crazy. Actually, um, I played in Plymouth in the OHL. We, we were kind of the same thing, a smaller city. Um, we would only fill about half in. It, it was pretty loud too, but nothing like here. You know, it, it bounces off the walls. And um, section, what's the section? And yeah, those guys are unbelievable. And I can't thank them enough. And, we just we just thrive off the energy and it, it makes us want to win more. Um, as a player, what do you take out of this year? As a player, I mean, um, obviously, uh, at the start of the year, I didn't want to be here. But the the only way to um, to succeed is is to win and, and uh, you know put up good numbers and and have a good team because. Uh, I was once told that the further the team goes, the further the individual is going to go, and that's exactly what we have here. Like you're going to be surprised to see the amount of guys that get that get contract offers and, and tryouts in different teams and different higher leagues and stuff like that. So at the end of the day, that's what we wanted, and we, we brought all we could to the table. And uh, it sucks we fell short, but it's uh, we got to learn, live and learn, and, and uh, hopefully we can have a good team next year. Um. Do you feel like you achieved personally what you wanted to, short of the obvious championship? For sure. I, mean, um, I feel like I had a great year. I, I, I stuck to my role as a player and uh, in both leagues, and uh, I think teams took notice in that. And, uh, I'm excited to see what's in store for myself and, and for other guys around me that haven't had that opportunity that, that I know will get that opportunity in a higher level, and, and uh, they'll be more than ready with uh, the coaching staff we had here. Last one for you. I know this is tough, but is there a, a top moment of the season for you? Top moment? Um, I got to go with, I, I kept looking back, you know, um, in the standings and, and we were kind of dropping a little bit. And I, I was getting worried. I really wanted to come back. And um, when, the, when the boys clinched the playoff spot with, uh, you know, short, short guys and when we got guys back, that was a, a big moment for me. To, um, to know that I was going to come back and, and try and help a team win a championship. and uh, It's been the best group of guys I've ever played with. And uh, just to see how hard they worked and, and, and overcome all the adversity with 
losing guys and, and stuff like that with call-ups and injuries and they they did all they could to get in and, and um, not only did we, did we win the first round we, we lost in game seven down more time to a to a really good hockey team who's probably going to win the championship and um, just a great group of guys.